All new at 10 tonight. They are loud, a bit creepy, and if you live in Broken Arrow, they just might be your new neighbors. 2 News reporter Brandon Richard is live to explain. Well, Karen, the new Bedford neighborhood here in Broken Arrow is all a buzz about the new residents. They just wish those new residents had found a different place to live. If you ask Broken Arrow resident Greg Ray about his new neighbors, he'll tell you they can be downright annoying. During you know morning times, there's just swarms of them, and I mean it's to the point where you you hear them banging against the window. Perhaps it would be one thing if they had their own place, but no, they've moved into Greg's backyard. I would say maybe three weeks ago is when you've seen the biggest influx of them. These black and yellow creatures, of course, are a type of wasp known as cicada killers because they're famous for killing cicadas, which is a locust-type insect. Good-sized bugs, maybe inch and a half, two inches mm -hmm. in length. Only attacks I've had is trying to mow the yard. You know, I try to wait till the evening time when they're less aggressive. But the problem's not just confined to Greg's house. In fact, several of his neighbors report having a similar problem. But they've learned to live with them. Really aggressive. We don't spend too much time in the backyard, so uh, not any, any issues with, you know, attacks or anything like that because we just simply stay away from them. Sooner or later, they'll be gone. Now, the OSU Extension Office says the insects can usually be found in the soil this time of year, and while they can sting, they're usually harmless to humans. Reporting live in Broken Arrow tonight, Brandon Richard, 2 News, works for you. Now, pest control products can kill these insects, but experts say since the wasps are beneficial, you should only kill them if there's a very large population.